Driver Survey is a form of control survey that links series of stations together by angles and distance. The function of drivers are Control and detail mapping General purpose angle measurement And lastly, for setting out and construction work The equipment used are total station Prism Tripod Measuring tape Picket Nail And lastly Hammer. The first step is we will set up the datum of 19 to 18 and find the two other point which is 20 and 21. Beware, both distance must be exceed 30 meters. Record the left horizontal reading from 19 to 18. Turn the instrument and side for side station 20. Record the first left horizontal reading to four side station. By maintaining the position of total station, repeat the step 2 until 4 by using face right bearing. Move the instrument to the next station. Record the first left and first right bearing for data. Difference between two face bearings must be 180 degrees. Calculate the average bearing. After finish, record all the face left and face right bearing. We will calculate the bearing misclosure. Write down all the bearing misclosure points and calculate the new bearing. After calculate the new bearing point, we will correct the bearing by follow the second class traverse. Next, we will calculate the average value for distance. Insert all the data from the traverse form and calculate the total distance. To find latitude, we will use formula distance cross bearing and for default, we will use distance sign bearing. We will use Bowdish method to find the correction. Insert the coordinate of north, south, and east, west. Transfer all the data to the SDR mapping. Insert data of latitude and depart. Insert the southest point of latitude. Add both value of southest point and add the next point of latitude to get the new value. Insert the westernmost point of divide. Add both westernmost point and add the next point of divide to get the new value for divide. Next, multiply value of 2 times latitude with value of divide. Multiply value of 2 times divide with value of latitude. Total of both value. Calculate the area of crevice. 